what's up youtube welcome back to our channel so today i'm excited i'm feeling happy yes guys and you guys want to know why i'm feeling this way right so today is our official 13 years anniversary in marriage yes guys even though Ozzy is not here Ozzy is in the u.s and i'm here in jamaica guys like trust me you're going to see stuff that me and Ozzy do together guys on the phone and how we celebrate our 13 years anniversary together guys to be honest it's not easy but you know by the grace of god we are going to overcome and we are going to pull through it because as i said in the video before like when you want good out of life, you have to make some sacrifice. And making this sacrifice for us is to go overseas. It's not easy, guys. But further down, guys, in a different video, I will let you know why I said it was never easy for me and us to make this sacrifice. But you know, when you want good, you know that around. So yeah, you today I'm feeling happy i'm feeling excited to be honest guys like 13 years in marriage yes you do have your ups and your down 13 years in marriage yes the teeth and tongue will meet but the end of the day guys you see love the word of god says love cover the multitude of sin and you see who got joined together nothing shall tear it as long guys listen to me my encouragement to marry couples out there always put God first. Me and my husband always make sure that God be the foundation and the center of our marriage. So this is the reason why we can here today just sharing all our life with you guys because guess what god always be our number one priority god always be the foundation not only in our marriage but in our life guys so god bless you today as you watch this video i pray that something out of this video will also impact your life guys so before we dive into that video clip for us to see what is taking place with the wifey and um, mr taylor also here Listen to me, baby boy, big up yourself. Happy anniversary again, and I just want you to know that I love you so much. You mean the world to me. You are my rock. You are my strength. You are my best friend. You are my partner. You are the love of my life. Okay, baby boy? So, guys, I'm going to hear what Mr. Taylor and someone are going with. What's up, my peeps? Um, so, as everybody know that um, today is my 13th anniversary and uh, let me say something to you 13 years in marriage is not easy and even spending my 13 years i'm in the u.s and my wife simone is in jamaica and leaving my family to come in the u.s to make life a bit better right it's not easy but me have to do what me have to do, right? And making sacrifice like those, it's not easy. Some relationship, um, they will have trust issues. I say, boy, baby, me not trust you, you know. Me not trust you, you go up them thing, anything you yeah. um, Let me say something to you. You see, in marriage, you have to trust your partner. You have to trust your partner. You have to be willing to do sacrifices to make life better me and simone married for 13 years and we got through a lot of things together i can remember days come that we don't have no food we don't have no food we don't have no money for send children to school i can remember one day that you know, me and my brother, me and brother Baker, eventually go to the bush for go cut wood to burn coal. And it was me, brother Baker, my wife, right? And we send off the children into school. So whenever them come from school, them know we are in the bush with them. Then, can't, then come over there. And let me tell you something. Someone where you sit there, stand by me. We burn coal. 
Yeah. We, we burn coal together. I remember we young, you know. And she never have to do it. She could have played like any hype girl and said, Oh, me not do that. I mean, I spend no time with no man where, Oh, I got burn coal and him not no money or something. She spent her time. And that's the reason why I love my wife. And that's the, the reason why my marriage is so unique. Our relationship is so good. Because guess what? Everything do from here. It do in the heart. You see, when you love somebody from the heart and also put God inside of the marriage, inside of the relationship, Trust me, no matter at this stage them in life you go through in a marriage, in a relationship, trust me, you'll make it. I can remember one time when we had the cold bush, right? And it's just me and her was there, Brother Baker wasn't there, right? And I can remember her skirt burst from top, from top, go straight up. So you could have say her underwear and stuff. I mean I say, geez, um, we never have a, um extra change of clothes or nothing. Right? Oh we're gonna do it. And I can't remember, I don't know if anybody knows Soja Maka. Soja Maka is the long one, the long maka. Right? And we take the soja maka them and, and kinda of stitch, 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 stitch it up. Right? And then, you know. Um, we wait until the little dust up and we go. I think the kids was there too, and we go home. So let me say something to you. There's a lot of stages in our 13 years marriage. A lot of times I will feel like, say, boy, trust me, boy, why really get married? I feel I go through some struggles and and thing. But let me say something. When I'm married, you yeah, have to go through something. The first and second year in our marriage, me and Simone marriage, trust me, it was a total disaster. Because guess what? I feel as a man that anything with me say, it have to goes. Me never care what Simone have to say. Anything with me say, it have to goes. And when I looked, I see, no, you're not supposed to go so. It's not supposed to go so not because you're the man. Right? It's not so it for go. I mean when I see God step in and change me and Simone because every day we used to argue, every day we used to to, to you know disrespect each other and, and, and stuff. And when we see God step in and change our life and change our story, right? And make our marriage can impact different marriage. I have to say thank God. So let me say something to you. If you are married and your marriage is crumbling, you are going through some hard time in your marriage. And sometimes they are saying, why me get married? Why me can't bother? Let me say something to you. Make God be the center of that marriage. And not because God is in the center of your marriage. You think so you're not supposed to go through nothing. You have to go through something. You have to go through something. And going through something. It's help you. Because when you go through some things you know. You have experience. And God carried through something because of a reason. And there's a lot of different marriage out there to 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 to, to impact to because and you alone go through the through it. Like oh me and Simone go through we can talk to you and tell us a listener, we go through hungry days. We go through days when we never have nothing. But look at us now. And we still not reach which we want to reach. You understand? But we still have God. We still have love inside our heart. 
with each other. Remember, if you're new here, just go ahead and like, share, comment, and subscribe. Turn on that post notification bell. And once God is the head of your life, you have nothing to worry about. Yes, you may go through thick lines to hands because we cannot run from it or we cannot escape it. But at the end of the day, just know that we all are an overcomer through Christ Jesus. Okay, guys. So let us dive straight into that video. Yes, I just want to say happy anniversary to you, baby boy. And I love you so much. And every moment we spend together, it's really love and appreciated. We have a, we have a bad moment, a sad moment, the times that we cry together. We go through so much over the years. But one thing to your facts, we always put God first in our marriage. We always pray together. We say the family that pray together stay together. And this, the word of God says, love cover a multitude of sin. We always use love to conquer everything else, no matter what we normally go to. So, babes, I just take the time out to say to you, said, even though you are not here, here in Jamaica with me this day, I just want you to know that I love you and I appreciate every moment that we spend together, babes. I love you so much. Happy anniversary, baby boy, Mr. Taylor, the love of my life, the man of my world, the man of my dream. I could never ask God for nothing better more than you. You are the man of my dream. You are my heartbeat. You are everything to me. You are my friend. You are my partner. You are my husband. You are the love of my life, baby boy. And I just want you to know, Mr. Taylor, that I love you so much. Okay? Love you. Yes. Love you too. And I want to make you know that, you know, um, at the anniversary, you will go on my side. I'm going to you me from Mr. Taylor, trust me. Boy. I miss her bad. I miss her, I miss her bad, I miss her bad, bad, bad. Like especially our anniversary. And boy, trust me, this day of Jamaica, five years, and then come back. It just feel awkward in a certain way. And I'm telling you, I miss you. I miss my family and stuff. And I'm sorry, I'm not be there at my anniversary. If spend some time together. Thing, but I just want to make you know that I really love you, I really appreciate you, my love, um, you know, the way oh God set our um, marriage, I understand that we understand each other, we respect each other, we love mm -hmm. each other, our, our, our um, marriage, our relationship, like, it's, it's, it's a, just a different, when we say totally different, just different, you understand that you can naturally feel the love that it's, it's just right. You understand? Mm -hmm. Feel the connection from the day that we meet until now. And boy, if you spend 13 years together, um, you know, I really love and appreciate you. And from the first time I met me see you, boy, trust me. Why me know I say I'm my own? You understand? I'm aware of a lot, a lot, a lot. A lot more years to come. You mm -hmm. understand? Mm -hmm. Make that content just bless our marriage or union. Amen. And make it can happiness, happiness, blessing, new doors and opportunities. No, and, man, Jesus. You know, God carries the places and continue and bless a lot of souls, a lot of persons, a lot of a marriage. You understand that? You know that the help I understand and we really appreciate um you babes for content virtual blessings really and uh, you know also I always love you you know so I mean I have my holy for words 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 but you know that's how my office of people really love you love you more <laughs> I love you more I love you more <laughs> yeah guys so as I said, me and Ozzy actually just get up. Now it's practically, I think about after four minutes, time. this time is about 
probably after five yeah guys so we are here we are here guys you know just spend the night together as i said before we actually sleep together at night time yeah so we are even though we are far apart in person we are not far apart when it concerning like you know spending time with each other on the phone and even the kids them but you know today is just me and us today me and us today so you know where have you been nah. yeah so <laughs> yeah so you don't know it in set guys 13 years together it's a lot of years to be honest because spending spending 13 years with someone in marriage like we are still young each day each day we learn a lot of different stuff we make ourselves available not only for me and my husband but you know which i will be to help out other person also the marriage them union listen to me people like married life is sweet me now got tell us the married life don't have it ups and down like if i say so i will be lying right mr taylor yeah, man. That's true. but the end of the day you both have to want it and yes when your marriage is hard in by god nothing beat that obstacle that you and your partner is going to trust me with the with God grace and mercy, you guys is going to overcome. Have its ups and downs. Marriage have them the sweet times and the bitter times. You understand? Mm -hmm. But but when those times comes, what you gonna do? It's not every time it's gonna be sweet. You understand? But but when the summer time come, what you gonna do? So guys, just stay tuned and uh, um you know it's our anniversary but we still we still have to spend time you understand and encourage that encourage people that marriage still works mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We, get we get married for um so young 21 and 22 right mm -hmm. and then when we will i see 13 years in marriage right and we have a a lot and that's the reason why i never do a short video clip so you guys can understand that marriage works and when you're out got inside of the marriage Amen. no enemy, no demons nothing from the people of hell can come to your marriage because the foundation built upon god hallelujah and the foundation upon god not weapon from against that relationship that marriage shall prosper so let me say something yes. you're watching this video stay strong stay courageous and know that god will keep your marriage will keep your relationship Amen. and just trust that each time 